Now, your WLKY weather with meteorologist Daniel Johnson. Yeah, Texas has had an unbelievable February. Very warm. Just last week, parts of Texas were in the 90s. Yeah, the 90s for highs in February. And of course, those wildfires. So some dangerous conditions out that way. Even here at home, it's been an interesting February. It's been a very warm one. 2024, this February, marks the fourth warmest February ever on record here in Louisville. And uh, records go back to 1871. And the third warmest February was just last year. So in the past couple of years, we've had some warm Februaries. And the numbers you see here, the 47.3, that's when you add up all the highs and all the lows in February. You add them together and then you average them out. So these are temperatures. So 47.3 was the average temperature for February. Right now, it's a bit chilly out there. You need the jackets. There's a live look outside downtown Louisville, nice and quiet ahead of some rain that we're expecting for tomorrow. 47 was the official high today. 26 was the low. It was a cold start as you went outside. Impact weather tomorrow, mainly in the afternoon and evening. That's when we're tracking the shower. So it's going to likely impact that evening commute. We're really not expecting a lot of rain, but we're making an impact weather day because it will be enough to make the roads a little bit slippery at times. So again, not a washout, best chance for rain during the afternoon and evening on Friday. So let's time it out on Futurecast. We're dry through the morning, just lots of clouds, maybe a sprinkle in the morning. Best chance will be as we approach your lunch hour, areas south of town toward the parkways, we'll see the rain chances first. Then it builds through the metro late in the afternoon and evening. So there's that evening commute looking a bit wet with just off and on showers. By midnight, Friday night into Saturday morning, the last bit of rain is beginning to push out. We'll trend drier into your Saturday, but right now, Saturday looks pretty cloudy, maybe some peaks of sun late. So how much rain? Well, I mentioned we're not expecting much, and you can see it here on this forecast map. At the end of the day, Friday, maybe a tenth of an inch to a quarter inch of rain, that's it. Highest totals south of the parkway. So here's your detailed Friday forecast. Chilly to start. Temperatures in the 30s in the city, probably upper 20s outside the city. Clouds uh, sticking around through uh, the first half of the day. Then the impact weather pushes in uh, later in the afternoon. Temperatures in the 40s with those off and on scattered showers. So where's the rain now? Well, we're dry, of course, just clouds beginning to push in. All the rain is down across Arkansas, Oklahoma, pushing into Missouri. Tennessee seeing a few showers and this will overspread the area heading into tomorrow. Right now it's chilly out there. Look at these numbers already down to freezing through Paoli, Scottsburg, Madison's of southern Indiana. Pretty cold. Basically, if you're outside the city, we're right around freezing at this hour and temperatures will hover near freezing in the city. Outlying areas getting a bit colder. Clouds continue to thicken through the overnight period. And here's a look at those lows. Notice the upper 20s. Uh, just outside the city, right around freezing in town. Tomorrow, similar to today in terms of temperatures, mid to upper 40s, but the difference, of course, will be the rain. But then here comes the weekend, the good news. Saturday, we made a slight tweak here. The clouds look to linger a little bit longer. We're still thinking some late day sun, but because of all the thick cloud cover, we dropped the temperature. We're gonna go with 59, but we'll take it. That's still warmer in the past couple of days. And then Sunday, that's the pick of the weekend. Just a few clouds possible. And we're talking mid 70s. So Sunday is the outdoor weather type of day. Even Monday, get out and enjoy. That's the warmest day. We're gonna go with 78 degrees. Another cold front brings us some impact weather by Tuesday with scattered showers and a few storms. A few showers could linger into Wednesday with a cool temperature of 59, but that's above average. So. We're flipping the calendar tomorrow uh -huh. to March. Comes in with a few showers, chilly temperatures, and then temperatures shoot up. There we go. Like that. Yeah. Yes, we do. Mm -hmm. Thanks.